Hey Hoopers, um, this is going to be a tutorial for the helicopter, which looks a bit like this. And, excuse me for doing that, okay, like this. Um, essentially, all you're doing is turning your hand like this and then passing it around your body, much like you would do with this, but instead you add a little bit of a twist in there. So, um, one thing that I'm going to say first before we start is that this trick took me quite a bit of time to get really fluid with before I was kind of awkward and a lot of time there would be these gaps when I was doing it where the hoop wasn't turning and to really get it, um, get the full effect you want the hoop to kind of be spinning the entire time. So the trick with that is to um, use your fingers and to allow yourself to give the hoop more rotations all the way around you as you're turning it. So that will probably take some time, but um, as you're practicing this more and more, it'll get easier and easier and um, it'll come more naturally. So what you want to be comfortable with first before you do this is just passing the hoop around you just like this. Just be comfortable with that motion because you're going to be doing basically the same thing just with a different hand movement. So once you've got that down, um, do the helicopter. You're going to be holding the hoop in your hand like this. And I usually will start right here. This is in my right hand. I'm just grabbing it. And what you're going to notice if you turn the hoop a different way, it's not going to feel quite as right. So I turn it in this way and duck my hand down and grab like this. And if you're going this way, you're going to notice that your hand doesn't really work. So um, you want to turn the hoop inwards towards yourself. So holding it here, and I'm going to do this as I'm moving my hand to the other side of my body. So I'll stand this way. So I'm turning the hoop inwards and then my hand's going to turn around and then I'm going to be grabbing it this way. So you'll see that the hoop is behind my back and my hands are kind of opposite here. I'm going to grab this and then be turning it around here until I'm back in the front. So like this, turning, 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 turning all the way until you can't turn anymore then you're going to grab it again here and do the same thing here. Just like that. So um, at first when you're doing this you're probably going to be, you're not going to have as many rotations and that's fine. Just do that until you can be comfortable with it. Maybe it's only turning once and you're grabbing it like that. And um, you'll get a lot more comfortable with it as you go. So what I usually do is I have the hoop here and I'm turning it inward. The other thing you can do to give yourself more rotations is to grab on the inside like this. So turning, turning, turning. Once I get back to here, it's basically up to my fingers now to give it that one last little turn. Then I'm grabbing with my fingers again here and continue turning it. So as you get more comfortable and more kind of I guess limber with doing this with your hands, you'll it'll become easier to turn it more and like continue those rotations all the way around. 